home to the Eagle Fruit Shell and the world's largest peanut. Pearsall, Texas also has some of the juiciest barbecue in the 23rd Congressional District of Texas. Welcome to Hurt on the Hill, Barbecue Pitmasters Edition. Why do it? Why own a barbecue restaurant? That's a good question. <laughs> Every time I smell barbecue, I just smile and think, hey, yeah, I remember that, you know, and, and I, my memory is just filled with, with great memories that are that center around barbecue. Right. You were able to do that recently um, for a lot of folks that were dealing with a horrific disaster. Hurricane Harvey um, hit Houston recently, and there's, there's a famous story about y'all just doing your part to help out. How did that, how did that come? That, that's, that's one of my fav favorite stories with our tenure at Cowpokes so far. We were able to, to feed a thousand, uh, a thousand meals that day, and, and I was just the driver. She coordinated it. Uh, all of our employees like Will and the rest of the crew, uh, a lot of them that were off the clock came in and said, hey, you're going to need some extra help. Wow. Right over there, we set up, set up a big assembly line over there. I called our bread supplier and he said, we don't have anything, but let me work on it. And he managed to scrape together some bread that was, he said, it's not, it's not out of date, but it's going to be, right. and it's got to go somewhere. So he donated, they donated all the, the buns and wow. everybody got together. it all pulled together. It was and, and, awesome. and what I like to just say, it was just Texans helping Texans. Right. That's all right. it was. It was Ca great. Caring about the community. Exactly. It really is. That really is an amazing story. You're the pit master. Yes, sir. What would you say to aspiring pit masters? Just keep practicing. That's all you can do. <laughs> you just gotta practice. And once you practice, cook a lot of meat, yes, right? Yeah. You'll, you'll get used to it. So anyone who's on 35 right. uh, knows about cowpokes. Why? Just the atmosphere, really. I mean, right. everybody around here is, you know, kind of a team going. And usually, you know, a lot of people come from out of town, even out of state, just to come get barbecue from here right. because of the way we prep our meats. Why do customers keep coming back? Uh, I think it's the friendly setting, good food. Uh, it's a place, is what I think. Armed with mesquite wood and a gas-fired smoker, Cowpokes for the last 25 years has been a staple of South Texas. And Steve, Christy, and Will showed us that selfless service to your community and hard work is another recipe for success. Thanks for tuning in to the Barbecue Pit Masters series and stay tuned for future episodes of Heard on the Hill as we highlight some of the cool things that are happening in the 23rd Congressional District of Texas. Thanks for watching. If you like what you saw, make sure you like and share this video with your friends and make sure you subscribe to our channel.